everyone! Today we're going to show you how to properly unbox and set up your SG500 or SG1000 printer. Let's get started. First, open the box. Set out all the contents and remove the packing material. Open the installation kit box and unpack all four ink cartridges. Remove all the orange tape on the exterior of the printer and remove the cable port cover and take off the tape. That port cover can be replaced. Lift the top cover and remove the tape along with the foam. Do not replace the foam. That foam can be discarded. Now, it's time to plug in your printer. If you're using Ethernet, plug that cable in first. If you're using USB, do not plug that cable in yet. Next, attach the power cord and plug it into the outlet. Once your printer is plugged in, press the power button to turn it on. The printer will now prompt you to open the front cover and insert the ink. Set the cartridges into their corresponding slots. Your printer will then run through a 7 minute initial charge. While you wait, load your heat transfer paper into your print tray, shiny side down. Now, it's time to download our Sawgrass Print Manager onto your computer by going to sawgrassinc.com slash install. Open the download and select your language and then click Install. Once the setup is complete, choose to manually reboot your computer and press Finish. Now, head back to your home screen and launch your Virtuoso Print Manager. Hit the Agree button and sign into your pre-existing account or create a new one. Once signed in, choose your printer and click Install. Click through the guides on your screen. If you're using a USB cable, you can plug that into your printer and connect it to your computer at this time. Do not make this printer your default printer. Once again, follow the prompts on your screen and hit the finish button. Then click on your print manager icon and select your set of inks. Now relaunch your print manager, then go down to the lower right hand side of your computer screen and click on your print manager icon to select printer utilities. Your print manager will now show you the amount of ink remaining in the cartridges. Do not be alarmed that the levels show less than 100%. That's because the ink has been drawn out of the cartridges to fill the printer lines. You still have all that ink, it's just been loaded into the printer, ready to use. If you're using Wi-Fi, you do not need to plug in an Ethernet cord or a USB cord. Push the menu button on the front of your printer. Use the arrow keys to navigate the menu. First, select System Settings and click OK. Next, scroll down to Interface Settings and press OK again. Select Network and press OK. Scroll down to LAN Type and click OK. Select Wireless LAN and press OK. Press Cancel. Press Wireless LAN Easy Setup and click OK. Then, go to SSID Auto Search and press OK. Select which wireless network you wish to connect to and click OK. Do not press OK, instead press the bottom button under the word Enter. Now, enter your wireless LAN password and click the bottom button under Accept, followed by the bottom button under Exit. Please note, if you want to go back a step at any time, you can press cancel. If this process does not work for you, there are several other ways to connect to wireless. Please visit our knowledge base at support.sagressinc.com to learn more. Now your printer is set up and ready to use. If you have any questions, be sure to check out our knowledge base at support.sagressinc.com. Thanks for watching and we'll see you again soon.